squash this hummingbird feared there's actually some mold is building up in here on the inside and it could be bad for the hummingbird so I'm gonna take this all apart and uh, put some dish soap in here Ooh, got some ants Soapy water and uh, clean all these up. I'm going to get rid of all that mold and any other nasty things that could grow on here. The sugar water, I think, is maybe more susceptible to growing bad things. Take out all these plastic flower feeder parts carefully without breaking the plastic if I can. There we go. I'll pop all those out. I'll do that later. And uh, that mold right there. Boy, this isn't a very big opening. Let's see if I get this wash rag in here. Oh, yeah. And that mold just wipes right away. And I wash this every time I refill the feeder, just to keep the little birds safe. Let's see how far I can get this rag in here and wipe that down. Uh, I actually have a uh, brush. This guy, let's see if that fits in there. Get that off of him. Soapy water. Oh yeah. There, then I can really clean that out really well. And there might be stuff that I can't see. So I'm gonna go over that really well. And I'll put them in the uh, dish rack, let them dry. I'm going to take, and I'll clean up all the rest of these. I'm going to take all those, all these flowers off, and then just take all these parts out, rinse them off, let them dry in the rack. Let's see the bottom piece. And then I take those flowers off and uh, wash that up and rinse it the same way and let them dry and then I'll uh, mix up some more nectar for the hummingbirds and uh, we're ready to go. Be sure and check out my other videos.